Okay, Terry, here we are at Olympia. You've just done your Grand Prix. How was it? Oh, it was great. I mean, like, it was a little bit hard job because it was really hot in the arena. But I think I managed pretty good. So I had a false free test and my best score so far. So I'm happy. And just tell me, what's it actually like to be here at this show? Oh, it's great. My husband comes from London, so it's the very first time that I'm competing actually in his home country and home city. So I think it's great. And for you, where are you based? How, how's the journey been to get here? I'm based in Luxembourg, although I come from Finland. So we did a stop in Calais just to take it easy. So good so far. And who are you riding here? Tell us about your horse. I'm riding Axis TSF, which is German bred Trakener Stallion, 14 years old, graded Elite Stallion, actually. And what's the partnership between the two of you? What have you done together? Oh, that's a very long route. I started riding him when he was three, so we know each other pretty good. So we call him the naughty one because he's still naughty all of that. We are very good friends. And what are your best achievements together um, as a combination? Uh, we co uh, qualified and competed in Rotterdam European Championships. So that's the best thing so far. So like I said, today I wrote my best scoring Grand Prix. So we're aiming now slowly towards the World Cup Finals. So what for you would be a great uh, score for tomorrow? What are your hopes in the freestyle? 77. I got a new freestyle, so I'm gonna, the, the churches will be surprised. We have been training a lot. So what, what's his star move? Tell me, what, what, how, do you, how have you made a freestyle for him? Oh, now we have done loads of adjustments about the choreography because earlier it was like too easy to go to World Cup. I have done already two World Cup seasons, but this time we have really put it up to the maximum. Does he have a movement that is uh, a, sh a showpiece? What's his favorite thing to do? Well, the easiest one for us is the half passes, which are like, we, he's a very flexible, good horse for that one. So that's probably, and the extensions. And after Olympia, uh, what's your plan for towards the end of the year? And what do you hope for 2014? So at the end of the year, we're going to have a free time. So I'm off then next year to Neumünster and Hertogensbosch. Well, that's actually sure, but the other plans are then open. Well, best of luck here this weekend. Thank you for talking to us. Thank you very much.